Hi there, and thanks for watching. Today I've got a special video for y'all. It is my transistor challenge video. I've done one of these in the past, but two things are different about this one. First off, you get to hear my beautiful voice. Dun dun dun. dun. And second one, I've added an additional requirement for difficulty. So let me go over the challenge first off. I played through Transistor and I'm on a new game plus and all limiters are active. That's a whole bunch of stuff that makes the game more difficult. And I can go into further detail at another point. I'll probably put something in the description that talks about the limiters, but for the time being, since I'm not accessing access points often, I'll just show you the one time I can and we'll go from there. Also, I won't be using the turn function, which essentially allows me to plan my moves to sort of navigate around enemies or really avoid damage, damage them. It's an integral function of the game, and I just don't want to use it, so I'm not going to. And also, I'm not going to be using access points, which help me save and do checkpoints and all that kind of stuff. Unfortunately, when there are chapter progressions, it does set a new checkpoint, but the goal of this is to do the whole game in one shot, all limiters active, no turn used, and no access points. So without further ado, let's go. Loading screen, loading screen. The dialogue right here is amazing. I'll explain it some other time. Hey, Red. We're not going to get away with this, are we? After you see me complete the game, come back to that point. There. Together again. Sort of. So go to the end of the video watch the ending and then come back to that point and you'll understand Yikes. so here are the builds and abilities back. i'm using i'll go over piece by piece the first one my damaging ability is i forget the name nice. of it but it does this aoe explosion pretty powerful and it also is applying a damage over time effect to enemies. And it's healing me for a portion of the damage dealt. This is the turn function I was telling you about. And this is the mandatory story time that one of two that you have to use it. It prompted itself. Thankfully, I can just exit it. So back to my damaging ability. It damages the enemies twice. Once on impact, which isn't for a lot, but then it also does the damage over time, um, like from that point. And then the AOE explosion is also giving us a little bit of damage over time reapplication. So it just suspends that ability a little bit longer. We're clear. And the beautiful limiters. Next up, we also have the cloak ability with the passive to reduce the timer on it. So it only takes seven seconds to recharge. And that's going to be my, oh no, I'm about to die move. Get out of town real quick. Hey, up there. Hello, world. Look at all that. We're on the edge of town, a hundred blocks away. So pretty. For my other active ability, okay? it's this black hole kind of thing. So <laughs> I'm going to keep using it for a second to explain it. What happens is it pulls in enemies and it damage. No, sorry, it doesn't damage them. It pulls in enemies and it stuns them, which makes them take more damage. And it also reduces the damage that they deal while directly causing them to take more damage. So again, it sucks them in, and the red ability itself makes the enemies do less damage and take more damage. And then it stuns them, 
which makes them take more damage I, as well, and crowd controls. Okay. So two forms, well, really three forms of crowd control together in she one ability. We can use her. Sad face, I'm sorry you're all like little digitized body parts. Intersection. Let's see. Wish it was raining. Cover your tracks. Rain's not even on the pallet. Warm and clear winds again. Where were we? Watch out. We're about to wreck some stuff that's trying to sneak up behind us. That's where we were. So you see how those enemies have a shield? The damage over time will penetrate the shield and then continue to hurt them. Otherwise, you'd have to hit them twice to damage them. Although the explosion is technically counting as two hits. Hey, end of the plaza. It's you. This is an iconic moment. Desperation. Damn. So for passives, I've got three on. You know how when I destroy the enemies, it sends out all these little bubbles? The cells? Yeah, it automatically pulls in cells that are a little bit further away. So it makes it easier for me to not have to run through enemies in, in different areas. And I also have one that gives me the shield, which blocks one hit of damage, and another one that makes me take less damage from all enemies and not be susceptible to slowdown effects. Okay, side street due east. Through there. I think I know a place we could get a ride. This is the second of it's two mandatory here. turn functions. You would think this is a boss fight, but it's not. Come on, that tough guy. Just hold on. This guy is actually a little bit harder because the healing factor that I have is lower. I hate fuckers. Creeps are bad, but fuckers usually worse. So fuckers shoot shells out that explode in a large area. Fuckers have this. Um, tractor beam that kind of sucks you in and does a lot of damage and if you have a bunch of them all at once they will kill you quick but I hate having enemies blast me from a distance really dislike it Back where they belong. bam and now here is the one time we have to Nothing. mandatory no. access the access point So these are my functions or abilities. We'll just look, take a look at the limiters in a second. Crash is the one that's doing the stunning and the damage resistance. I've got two of them. Get is the one that's pulling enemies in like a giant black hole. Spark is the name of the ability that's actually doing the damage, causing the explosions. Purge is the additional damage over time effect and slowing effect, super nice. Tap is what's giving me some health leech on my damage abilities, which does slightly stack with purge. Void is the one that's making the enemy's defense and attack get lower, and also the like the main focus, the ability to pull enemies in, like this is the one that I would use for that period. 
And I'm also using Bounce, which gives me the protective deflective shield, negates a single hit of damage. Again, gets pulling things in. And uh, Mask, this is the one that makes me cloak. On top of that, Ping reduces the cooldown of the cloak ability, so it only takes 7 seconds instead of 10 to recharge. Now let's take a look at limiters. The first one, the process will spawn shielded cells when terminated. I have to pick up cells or the enemies will respawn. So having the shield around the cells is just another dynamic to make it harder for me to gather them, which is, you know, so enemies don't respawn and kill me. But it's even worse when you combine it with one of the other limiters. I'll, see, I'll show you in a sec. This one efficiency just increases the damage that the enemies hit me for. Well, you know, it's quite powerful. This one over here, abundance. The process will sometimes spawn twin cells when terminated. That's a big one because now remember they have shields around them and sometimes one enemy will die, but then two will respawn if I don't pick up those cells fast enough. This one makes those cells have a lower timer, so I have to pick them up, up much quicker than before, also making it more difficult. And now I don't automatically activate turn at low health. Normally that move would happen so I don't die. It's like an automatic feature, but not anymore. User will lose access to six memory or more. This basically means I can't equip as much nice stuff as I normally would. So. Whoops. So my build is heavily gimped. I have to play with fewer abilities and fewer passives, making it harder. Over here, we've got user will overload more functions at once and recover only one per access point. Now this is pretty bad because when an enemy kills you, it will wipe out your ability to use a function, which cripples your ability to do whatever damage or build you have. And it's really hard to recover from this and that means you don't get them back. Well, it's it's really hard because it limits your effectiveness in that particular encounter, but it also takes you a lot longer to put those skills back on. Since we're not using access point, it's not necessarily a big deal, but it is still necessary to point out if you didn't have the other limiters on and just this, it would still be bad. The spawn corrupted cells thing, if you look at the cells, they either have no little black orbs floating around them or they do corrupted cells are the ones that I don't have to pick up but they will damage me if I do by accident so when I defeat an enemy and those cells go flying everywhere if the shield happens to break and a corrupted cell lands on me it damages me I can't avoid it this one means if I unequip or change any of my functions at access points which I won't be using it will automatically overload them which is kind of a big deal if you if you have this one equipped and priority equipped, you can actually increase the difficulty with just those two. And the last one, more enemies are spawning. So I have a ton of enemies spawning all over the place, raining cells of destruction down that I have to pick up and doing tons of damage to me in the process. Good. But it's just pun intended. I want to show you something. Okay, there's a wait. Wait. Back, 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 back. Back, 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 back. So remember I was talking about crowd control earlier? Let me tell you all the crowd control I have in these abilities. Because the healing is almost secondary to the crowd control I'm doing. First we have the ability to pull the enemies together. Which obviously if something's running up in my face and I pull other enemies away from me, it's, it's saving my life. Then literally that same ability is going to be reducing the damage the enemies do to me on top of that they're also getting stunned so they're going to do less damage they're going to take more damage and they're going to get crowd controlled by literally clumping them together then i shoot this exploding thing at them and it slows them down so they're stunned slowed stuck together and debuffed Offensively, attack speed wise, damage increase wise. Okay. E64 on really a Take the spectacular right. build. Do not turn left. Got pretty yeah. much everything that you'd want Thanks other than left. super high damage in one hit. Hi. You turn left. Thought we were 
have skipped town. I thought so too. What happened, yo? We're going back there. You meant these things. They do not have a sense of humor. They will track you down, wipe you out, and take whatever's left of me back to those two bit camarada pieces of trash. Don't, Don't let, let me, me go. go. Can't say I've memorized the whole game. But I love the dialogue. I love the narration. Supergiant Games is one of my favorite game company. Actually, no. It is my favorite game company of all time. <sighs> Poor bike. Just ten more blocks to the side. Better than Sony. Better than Capcom. So there's a couple things I can do when battle starts. You usually see me grouping enemies because it also stuns them. And that, usually if I stun them, they don't even have a chance to do damage to me. Plus, it makes them take more damage. So it's like, hey, you want to kill the thing that's trying to kill you faster without them killing you? But if there are man enemies, they'll summon these things called haircuts. And haircuts hurt. Because they don't know how to give haircuts. They just blow up in your face. Terminal still up. Footinch. Must be starving. Sea monsters really the only choice here. Or that. Just have to get back to your place before it gets cold. Yep. And then enemies. Now you notice how it's getting healed because the healing aura of this one enemy is giving it a lot of health back fast. I could choose to not kill those enemies as they pop up and then they'll just keep spawning and respawning and respawning. Ooh. For some greasy flatbread. Uh, fertile ground. Never seen gold walk cleared out. Those Sorry, I'm I'm looking at the stream of light coming from the projectile. Okay, so this is gonna be chaos, and this is one of the areas that is a little bit harder and easier to die. Hey, I cloaked. I literally don't know what just happened. Okay. Let's do this. See? I can be doing everything else that I want to do just fine. And then these guys show up. Yay! I'll take that. Thank you very much. Goodbye, access point. Out of the channel in record time. Eight blocks off. Almost there. Trouble. Hopping up like weeds. I love it. This will lag the game, by the way. If you haven't noticed, it's got a couple of spikes here and there. Just passing through. I love how she hugs the sword. Or not. Let's not stick around. They're in line for the 
morning show. Now to mop up. That was a pretty powerful hit. I guess we're done here. Yay. Hope you're wearing comfortable shoes. <laughs> I know, right? Here we are. I'll say. Except for him. Unless you count him. Hi. Where'd Where everybody, everybody go? go? Well, we're gonna get you out of here. He says the process wiped him out. He's too far gone. They know we're here. Sure do. It'll be easiest if I take out these things on the outside so I can hide behind the walls. Of course, in doing so, I'm going to be destroying the walls. I had used flood instead of this exploding ability it would do tremendously higher damage and much higher healing but at the cost of left the lights on. at the cost of having to be much closer to enemies Sounds good to me. Gotta be a leader somewhere. Kinda nice with all these curtains, but I'm just thinking open air. It must be hot. Although they can control the weather in the city, so maybe not. Hmm. Yeah, that's a thought. When I first saw you up on that stage back there, it was like everyone loved you. Come on, man, just tell her you everyone love her. Yeah, if you can control the weather, having a giant air-conditioned outside area, that would be awesome. Can they kill the mosquitoes too?
Man, why are you gonna be slinging swords? Pretty cool dress. I like it. Don't be gone. Please don't be gone. Hey. Is that you? Oh. Look at you. You're alive. Me, I'm not so sure. Could use your help. Hey, say something already. Say something, will you? Something. Oh, no. Something. Time to fight our very first boss. I wonder if I don't do anything, what will happen? Oh, you build OP. Hello again, Sybil. Your camarada friends. I want you to tell us where they are. Do you understand? We got our lead. We're going downtown. The process will be waiting for us. Hey, hey. You'll be back someday. I feel like that's a prophetic statement on his part. As I say every time we get to this point. I'm kind of hoping this other one would come close enough that I could hit him both.
pretty nice explosion build, right? Still a step ahead. But they haven't stopped us. Oh, we gotta take a peek in there at least. Oh, he says a different line this time. Normally if you talk to that access point, it spawns enemies. They or you could just worst. spawn them. Come on, go over there. You, go over there. They're just spawning weed after weed after weed. Not like I'm complaining. But they really are spawning a lot of extra weeds right now. It's not like they're respawning. I'm picking up the cells. Bam. No sweat. 14. Not bad. So let me get this straight. The Camerata. They think they can stop you with these process things. Maybe. But you're just getting stronger. It's calling them up. When it comes to those construction devices, it's better to defeat them and then deal with enemies if they had raid spawn. Because those construction things will continue to make enemies spawn. And that's really a big pain. Something I failed to mention before, if I cloak before I use this exploding ability, it doubles the damage of the next attack. That must be how they get here. We better hustle. High rise is dead ahead. So that fight Across is where I messed up the last run. Which was not a bad thing because I got to try out new builds and I found one that was a little bit better. Much nicer last time we were here. Surprise, surprise. What's going on? Hello? The enemies that are generated in each of these areas changes every time you play through. Once you get past a certain point, like when you beat the game and you're on New Game Plus, any enemy from any zone can spawn. killing myself because of those exploding haircuts. Nice Yay. I agree, we did. By we, I mean me. Guess who? Get out of there. Good 
This might be challenging. Let me regroup. Let me get to a neutral area. Gotcha. Golden. Gotta say, I'm I'm Flight digging the extra range on, of this it. setup. Hey, is anyone out there? I thought so. Uh, you might want to be careful with what you're asking, Pat. Yikes. They got more friends. Run. Oh, I Just can actually. Run kind of stuck him over. Yeah, I didn't there. know that. I'd be interested if I could actually kill any of them. Time to run away. Made it. That was 50 of them back there. Maybe more. careful because I thought I could lure them all around and apparently that was a miscalculation. See I'm pushing to the left. I was trying to shoot it where I wanted to but it was automatically aiming at the enemy. I guess if I was playing on PC, I could literally put it wherever I wanted. Get out of our town. Head on I thought I was going to die. I'm glad I didn't. Coast if I wouldn't have died, I would have lost the ability to cloak, which here. would have been yes. limiting. See? See how More messed up the cluckers are? Still with me. Thankfully, I get the health back pretty quick, but man, I really don't like having to deal with them. And now there's more. Three for one. Stay out of our way. You see this? This is what the Camerata want our town to be. Going up. Shh. 
Should be able to get him through here. Yep, I think you are Suspect. correct. So far, so good. Next stop, high rise. Something's wrong. Get ready. Really? I killed more than two enemies. Almost there. Welcome to High Rise. Welcome home. Yep, High Rise for the rich and famous. It's been a while since I've seen fetches spawn. Yourself, I'm good. Really? Locked yourself out. How are you gonna? Well, either the door is like clear and there's a bunch of lights on on the inside, or the door is glowing in the dark. It all looks fine from up here. Can you imagine trying to find the keyhole on a glow in the dark door? Blinded in the middle of the night, kind of mumbling and stumbling around. The ability to pull enemies in and stun them and slow them down is really the whole reason this can even work. Because other than that, I'd need some way to get so much health back. What happened was, <laughs> I wrecked their faces. My mom I've seen no one trapped inside the sword. How's it going? Uh, it's going alright. Yeah, I'm still here. Oh good. 
what? He was like blocked off maybe and couldn't see me and that's why he thought that? Oh, you see how much damage a haircut can do? <laughs> Sorry, the voice actor did a good job on this part. You can hear me, right? Yes, I can. I want to fight this optional encounter. Waves. So I'm going to go inside this door. This is the dev room. Sorry, bro. You're about to have a rough day. I mean, you're trapped inside of a sword. Oh, back from break. And optional encounter start. I kind of like that I can destroy things through walls pretty easily with this. And that's why we stay away from haircuts, ladies and gentlemen. I should have cloaked the moment I saw it or manually attacked it. Another one of these with those exaggerated spawns. get the haircut to explode next to him it'll do tons of damage to him too and that's typically how you do it you want to either destroy it on impact like the moment it gets summoned if you're too far away or try to use the black hole to suck the haircut away from you You would say that. So check it out. This is the checkpoint that I had on the last file. This file that I'm playing on now. And this is the one right at it. Try to knock it out as fast as possible with as much damage as possible. Really need to kill off the operator quick. 
Because all these extra things are not going to stop spawning even after they get down. So these crazy scenarios where I got tons of enemies overwhelming me, it doesn't get better, it's it worse. See? I wonder how many enemies it's going to spawn in for this fight. Because it's still going. Beautiful. B E A U T F U L. That's my star. Could always hit twenty one. <laughs> twenty one. I love you so much, Red. You know that, right? He's like drunk or something. He finally says he loves her. It's true. It's true. I believe you. Wow, that's a long time. Eighty-three thirty-five. Top of the town. This tower's changed a thousand times. It's got to be pretty old. Every time, every time you cast a vote in this town, it gets tallied, sorted, somewhere here. Another chance to make Cloud Bank a better place. <laughs> Seems like you're safe. I take full credit. The spine of the world. Oh boy. Would you look at the time? Yep, sure is, pal. Sure is. Back there. I think that was just the tail. These cheerleaders are a problem because they make the enemies get a shield, which also stops the enemies from taking damage. Which stops me from being able to heal. Ah, oh, this is really bad. This is really, really, really bad. Like, really bad. Yep, not good. I mean, the thing coming down from the ceiling is also hurting enemies. Ah, 
junk. All right, haircut, do your work. Man, how did it still hurt me? I didn't know there was a second one. Wait, I can damage the spine? I didn't know I could damage the spine. Huh, I never actually defeated the, it. Nope, 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 nope. Ah, it blew up. Is it not coming down anymore? I guess the purge ended up killing it. I didn't know you could defeat it, or else I would have done that like ages ago. Not over yet. But now I can know I can defeat the spine. Sorry, I'm also talking to people in Discord. Hello. How did you get in there? Hey, at least if we get through this, we'll get to say we were there. Yep, she's gonna rip its heart out. She's gonna. Whoop, nope. Thanks. Appreciate it. Thanks for leaving me alone. So you might be onto something there, pal.
Well, looky there. Why did I stop? Why'd you stop? That's a nice color, purple. Colors of purple. Almost. They did a really great job with the art. Like, look at how beautiful these worlds are. I don't know if it's just a bunch of filtering or the person that was in charge of the design just did a really good job. So this boss fight's gonna be a little bit dicey. What's the difference? Never mind. I'll tell you later. Uh Wow, it took all that time to load it? It was supposed to be a boss fight. There's supposed to be a boss fight. Red, Red wait. Wait. Please be. I can't. I gotta keep it voided so it does less damage to me. <laughs> no lag at all, right? Oh, look at that. Convenient. There's a heart. I think chopping off the head would be enough, but nope. Sure are. Looks like you got a message there. Greetings from the camera. It's really you. Come all this we'll way. We'll find them. Maybe they'll be cordial. We sincerely regret any inconvenience or actions may have caused you. Here's your voice back. Here's your body. Have a nice day. Bracket Towers Concourse. Never had the pleasure. So let's see here. Nice big door. They're not so bad if you know how to deal with them.
I can always use that ability for some more firepower. think you're thinking right if I touch the safe point down there it would spawn more enemies on this area conversely I should be Got able to do it here waiting. why are they even here when everything changes nothing changes that's the camaradas creed our mission we love our city the way it is we didn't want to see it fade because someone out there didn't like the color of the sky Everything we did, everything we're doing, is for Cloud Bank. Liar. He's lying. Why wouldn't he be? What if they even want with us? Gonna spawn the fucker again. As long as I can keep them together, I'm fine. Come on, I destroyed that one. I'll just have to take y'all out a little bit at a time. See, the mechanics behind some of these fights really do make them challenging. Who else? I guess it would also be worthwhile to do a single turn fight, like a uh, playthrough where every single kind of fight was only one turn. We're on the top level. Oldest archives. Photo op. Nice. Well, let's see what we can find up here. Look at the power energy waves. Found something. Close.
that. Should be some kind of override. Like that one. Exactly like this one. Knew it. Should be another one just like this, other side of the tower. Let's get back to the concourse. I solemnly swear everything written here is true. Know that I am responsible for these heinous acts perpetrated against the city of Cloudbank. My accomplices are Sybil Rise, Royce Braggett, and Grant Kendrew. We alone are to blame. Yes, you are. Perhaps our worst sin is you will get no justice. For now, we all share the same sentence. What have they done? Still shut tight. First set of locks are down low. This isn't what they wanted. The process. Those things. They don't answer to us anymore. They don't answer to anyone. We thought maybe we could stop them without the transistor. As you can see, that isn't going well. Though I suppose you're not about to just hand it over, are you? After all we've done. Um, yeah, not really, not gonna do it. Good question. Yeah, if you didn't mess with me in the first place, we wouldn't be in this boat. The other override ought to be in here. Maintenance. Count of three. Three. say easy I say cheerleaders are a pain in the butt and it could easily just kept hyper spawning stuff Yo, y'all gonna like back off it please, thanks. Appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. Guess you should be flattered. It was nothing personal, you know. You were valuable, handpicked, unique, but one of many. All we needed was your point of view to give the people what they didn't know they wanted. That's all we ever wanted. All Grant ever tried to achieve. The rest was merely incidental. What good could four individuals ever hope to accomplish in this city with only their own four voices? Well, we found our answer. You have it right there in your hands. You could have asked. You could have asked for my help. The ringleader's right upstairs. Well, round and round. soon you'll find out. Backstage access. Not now.
Yeah, I don't know about all that. These are still hard enemies. The haircuts are really the, the only bad part about them, though. If they didn't have that, or the ability to cloak, then it, they would be inconsequential at best. Seems like it might be a better strategy to lure them out with some AoE explosions, do some damage on them, do some slowdown effect, since it really stacks quickly. That's two. Big door downstairs ought to be open now. Yup, I think it is. Take Get ready for the big boss fight after these doors. Out of all the fights, that's one of the most fun sites that is set in stone. Doesn't change. Hey, something I've been meaning to tell you. Once this is over, maybe there's still time to skip town. Think about it. Standing offer. I'm thinking. I was surprised the first time. Left you a note. So that's it. I couldn't stay to meet with you in person. Grant, he couldn't wait any longer. Why he would leave me? I'd sooner take an eternity in the transistor. But he was no longer seeing straight. Not with that alcohol. Decided he'd seen enough. We knew the stakes of what we wanted to accomplish. And we knew that if we were to fail, we would do so together. As one. See you in the country. That's jacked up. Yeah, that's messed up. Hey there, remember me? The guy you killed the other day? Let me be the first to welcome you to your new home. You fake. Wake up, buddy. Got some questions for you. How do we stop this? Fairview. How are we supposed to get all the way over there? Oh. Jump for it. We're not gonna fall. 
I believe you. I mean, follows relative, right? Yeah, if only we could fly all the way there. It's time is up. Your stage. No, you don't. Little punks. Good stuff. Not too shabby, if I do say so First myself. Oh wow, it bounced off the one piece and then it got sucked over to another. One came back. Yeah, I know. I want to kill this thing first. But I'm getting my butt handed to me over here. <laughs> I guess not. I got a little dicey there. I did not. I did not execute that very well. I cloaked to go kill an enemy, but then he ran away, and then I saw stuff was respawning, so I went after the respawns instead.
This is gonna be good. Hey guys, what's new? Hello. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I love the music behind this. It's very catchy. Oh, oh no. You're still there. And I'm still here. You're, You're still, still there, there. And I'm still here. <laughs> Is that what I Yep. Oh sixteen million times access. This is usually another tough fight, and with cheerleaders, this will be no exception. I guess I just mean you. I'd say the cast time for the abilities borders on making it impossible to actually do this or very difficult. There are other ways to manage. For instance, the mask ability, the one that cloaks me, I could have attached that as a passive instead, which gives me a two second activation after I defeat an enemy. So if I decided I wanted to, oh, look, a little creep. So I, yeah, maybe I do. So yeah, I could have put that on instead. Where's our beautiful bike? Hey, step away from the bike. Yeah. Hey, Red. It is. Good job, Mike. Thanks for the lift. Sad face. The whole city. I Bye, 
Scott deserves some kind of reward. Not to get wiped out like all his bike friends. You go first. Yikes. This is gonna be Spawning fun. Season. Check it out. Red wing. Hi, ladies. And get ready for lag very soon. Yeah, but now I'm going into the next fight with not full health, and that's going to be rough. What? Get back. Listen, jerk. <laughs> Boom. They took a chunk out of the floor. Took it where, though? I love the commentary. It's like, where do you think the floor went? That's the most important thing that we need to know right now. doing surprise those still work I accidentally pressed the turn uh, anything else before we head really out? this is your vote it's a choice you read my mind look at this we got the key to the city Yeah, but all the people are dead, so Hello, maybe I would rather not have the key to the city. You don't look so good. Almost there. Last member of the Camerata. He'll be expecting us. Look out. Get away. Still got that human guy over there. I'd still summoned it. That was interesting. We shall, we shall see.
transistor. What can it do? What can it really do? Well, yeah, 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 come on, come on. A bridge, for example, that's something. People want a bridge to Fairview. This better work. Why not? It's settled. Have a beautiful new bridge. It's good for more than just bridges, of course. Plank can make wow. not anything happen. Really? You asked for it. You got it. To Fairview. Fairview. I like the name Royce. It's pretty nice. I like the sound of it. The process can't be stopped. Can't be stopped. However, the process could be impelled to simply go away. Take its business elsewhere. And we'll be well enough alone. As for the town, we'll have ourselves a blank canvas. And Where are we supposed to? Sir? We'll have oh. ourselves a brush. <laughs> trying times. Very trying times these days. Grand would be others' take. Gone ahead, let me now have a thing. Just you and me now. You and me, and the transistor. Yeah, I got nothing. We had a saying, which goes, when everything changes, nothing changes. You see, when everything changes, nothing changes. But all this, this isn't what we had in mind. It's a fair view. I don't care so much about the snapshot. I care more about Mr. Man over here. So don't let your friends borrow your magic sword. We Got it. Here we go.
how many more enemies do you think it's going to spawn this round? Because it's already pumped in, I don't know, eight or nine extras. And there we have it. That was rough. Getting pretty close to the final boss encounter. Gotta keep going. Let's fly. Everyone always said you could be anything you want in this town. This is it for me. Yeah, you want to be a sword? I mean, whatever works, bro. There's these traces inside the transistor. Everyday people once upon a time, but now, well, not quite themselves. And they're trapped. No walls in there, mind you. It's just, they're on their own. Listen close enough and maybe you can hear them. Some of them, I mean. The ones you know. Just a bit farther. So you can hear people trapped in the sword if you know them. Got it. Cheerleaders are the worst. At least right now. See? The worst. Thankfully I have my ways of dealing with them. Still doesn't make it easy dealing with them. But if I chain cast this, whenever they become available to damage, like when their shields go down, they're going to be stunned so I can actually hurt them. So I stun lock them until their shield tracks. Bro, y'all going heavy with the cheerleaders. That should do it. Yay. Nine of them. If Royce can hold them off, so can you. Yeah, but he probably has a cool supercomputer or something Next. to do it for him. Yeah, going upside down, not my favorite thing. Oh wait, I couldn't just walk through the door? It changes shape all the time, right? Bridges, parks, highways, rising and falling. Rising and falling. At the people's whim, with the changing of the seasons. Even the seasons, they're just whim. Why, I guess I grew weary of it. After a while, things changing all the time. I mean, you were chief engineer of the city. Of course, it would be kind of sad to see your work go to waste over and over and over again. Nothing else is going to spawn this time, just the two guys? All right. Uh, not that I'm complaining. We're, what, one fight away from the final boss? So far, I've managed to not die. Which way? Grand, half my life. Principal persuasive man. Very persuasive. 
I'll miss him. He appreciated my work, supported my endeavors. Cameron, I didn't see his idea. I was all for it. All for it at first. But there, well, I'd say the rest is history, but that's not quite the case. Nope. And you know why it's not the case? Because there will be no one to record it. Hey, look. A back door. Let us not this delay the inevitable. There you are. That's one down, plus whatever else is about to spawn in here. Hey look, another thing spawned in here. Called it. Ouch. He got me straight on with that haircut. Could easily kill me too. And that was two haircuts I got hit by. It's throwing everything under the sink at me right now. Now the wall's down and I can get the last of them. Okay, cool. Time to defeat the boss. For a reason. So, I want him to finish. Please, don't let my work go to waste. Be right back. Bathroom and water. I'm being reasonable. Now, full disclosure. Full disclosure here, which is, I am one, positively certain, one hundred percent, that this will work. Which is, transistor plus cradle equals no more process. No. Funny business, okay? We'll just take it one thing at a time. One topic at a time. Look, if this was if this was all just some kind of ruse on my part, I mean how base. Why would I lead you all this way? I'll level with you, yes, I would like it back. I'd very much, if you must know, but you know what? At this point, I would settle for not being wiped out of existence. I would happily settle for that. Okay, so now I'll wait. If you want me to wait, I'll wait. But the process, the process, as you can see, patience isn't one of its virtues. Always busy. Busy, busy, busy. Whenever you're ready, 
which I hope is going to be soon, but I will say no more. Hmm. You sure about that, pal? <sighs> Sorry, I'm back. Had a quick snack. All right, let me turn off this overlay because I'm going to try to try to pull some of the video and make like a well, you'll see if I pull it off, I'll pull it off. Yes, sir. What have we got to lose? It's why we're here. Came all this way for a reason. Just get it over with. Yeah. All right. Thanks, pal. I love you too. It's time. Not like how you mean it. But thank you. But I will see you again. I will see you again. I know you can hear me. Process. I think we got it. Contained it. So, the town is going to be alright. It's just, well, someone's going to have to rebuild. But we flew a little close to the flame there, so... Now, we're here. Not there. We're stuck. And, unfortunately, the only way back that I'm aware of is, well... Unpleasant. So, let's get this over with. Prepare yourself. All right, I can do that. Uh, nope, not that one. This one, yes. This one, yes. And we're gonna go with this guy right here. And we're gonna go with that guy right there. And we're gonna go with this guy right here. What am I missing? I, got, I feel like I'm missing something, but I don't know what. I mean, I know this. Oh, that's what it was. Okay. This to pull in the cells. This to make cloaking faster. Got it. All limiters active. Final boss fight. Let's go. This is now the only time I will be using turn, as you are going to find out very soon.
You should have died from that. Ah, uh, he's invisible and I can't hurt him. Who? Thought it would be blocked. There we go. See how I'm not really getting a lot of health back? This is why this fight can be challenging. See that big blast area? It's not actually that big. It's only if that projectile hits me. Oh, wait. Yay. They still got off one more attack against me. There's not much I can do about that. Actually... Pull him away. Challenge rock. No, please don't be gone. Please don't. Mm-hmm. 
back to your place in High Rise. Fit some gold walk. Junction jams. All the drinking joints in the canals. What are you thinking? Well, I'll tell you what I'm thinking. It kind of stinks that she has to hum to fix things. Can you imagine if she couldn't even hum? <laughs> Get ready for Dare. tears. Don't do this. Please. If you do this. Red, please don't. Wait. Red. Red. No. Red. And the transistor claimed its last victim. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for joining me on this incredible adventure. I really love Transistor. It's an amazing game. It's everything from the art, narrative style, and the battle system, the enemy design, everything amazing game 